Hi everyone, it's Valerie um, and it's Pertia Paper and Lace. Um, thank you for visiting my channel. Um, I am going to try to film this. This is my fourth attempt to film this. Swap with Dawn. Um, everything that could possibly go wrong um, has gone wrong. My first video was a mess. I screwed everything up. The cat bit me. and But you know what? I'm going to post that one because it's hilarious. I laugh every time I see it. Um, then I come in here this morning to do it and my battery's dead on my camera so I had to wait till that charged up. So now finally here I am. I'm really excited to share this with you. Um, I did the boho swap with Dawn and she did not do a boho book for me she did a soft cover and I want to share that I love it it's amazing but first I want to show you her kit she was kind enough to send me a printout of her kit and on the first video that I made that I am going to post because it's nuts you'll die laughing or be bored to tears either one I don't know but anyway um, I said that this was um, Hewlett Packard paper, but it's not. It's her. It's called um, Epson, and it's a double-sided um, matte uh, paper. And she does talk about it in one of her videos. And if I can find that video, I will link it under um, the description of this video. Um, but this is. It's just beautiful, and I was going to buy her kit anyway. Um, although she's printed it all out for me, but I'm still going to go over there and buy it because she printed on one side and left this blank so um, you could journal, but I think I would actually like to have some of this double-sided just because this kit is just gorgeous. The colors are vibrant. Um, I love the um, Victorian style um, ladies and um, gentlemen there but it's mostly ladies and look at those two isn't that I hope you can see it my last attempt everything was out of frame it was just a, a royal mess um, this almost the background almost looks like the paper that um, Sirius Hecka makes with her um, um, I forget what all she does. I did it before. That's um, flower petals and um, other things and um, onion skins. That's what it is. And it's beautiful. So she might have tried that. I don't know. But isn't this just beautiful? I won't go through every one, but she has um, a lot of ephemera with this as well. And envelopes. There's one. There's other colors of envelopes. She's really done a gorgeous job. So um, if you haven't seen this kit, some of this is upside down, I apologize. But run over to Dawn's page, her Etsy store, and um, look through it. You'll probably want it as well. So I'm definitely going to do that. So that's her kit. It's gorgeous, Dawn. Thank you so much for printing this out for me. I'm actually going to do some tags today, I think, and I think I'll use some of this on the tags. So there's that. You know, here is the book, and um, it's beautiful. It's beautiful. Um, isn't it gorgeous? I love it. She's put beads on it. And um, I didn't tell her a whole lot um, about what I like, but I did tell her, you know, I love animals. Um, I had horses almost my entire life, not any longer. My horse passed away a couple years ago. Um, I miss him. I had him for 24 years. He was my buddy. He was 29 when he passed. And I did not get another horse because there's no one like him. I just couldn't replace him. So anyway, um, so she kept that in mind that I liked lavender. My color, my favorite color was purple. And I love dogs, cats, horses. I mean, I've had everything. You name it. So this is the beautiful book that Dawn has created for me. And she's put this beautiful butterfly clip there. It's just, oh my goodness, this doily little flower with the button and this. Look at this. It's just layered so beautifully. And it looks like this was a pattern fabric that she... Um, Put a little bit of coffee stain on to um, vintage that up 
and then these beautiful beads. And what I like about this is the outside um, is like a um, suede type of a leather appearance, but yet the beads go so well with it. It's like it's not too manly, you know, or too, um, I don't know how to describe it, too woodsy or outdoorsy, but it's just got everything. I love it, love it. Don, you just, I, I couldn't have made myself anything I would like better than this. And the, the pattern papers that she's used, it's just gorgeous. Look at this. It's just so full of goodness. I can't get over that. Look at that. That is just amazing. And the plaids, um, I love the plaids. I love the polka dots. I love stripes. This paper is beautiful. I'm going to try to go through this semi-fast because um, I've made so many attempts at this. I just want to get this up so people can see this beautiful book. And I think this is the wax paper that Lisa does, Serious Hekka. Um, and the butterflies. I love butterflies, dragonflies. I love all of that stuff that Dawn's added in here. And she didn't know that, so that's amazing. And this is an Edith Holden page, and it's just gorgeous. July. I love it. And a, just a piece of extra coffee-stained paper. And I'm going to use this book, Dawn. Thank you so much. I love it. I love that. This texture is gorgeous. I don't know what kind of paper that is, but it's beautiful. And isn't this amazing? It's just the entire book is just gorgeous. I love it. It's me. It's me. And the hankies. I think this was either a hanky or maybe a napkin. I think a hanky. Isn't it beautiful? And these cards. I don't know where she got these, but wow. They're amazing. I just love everything about it. I love the little garment pins. And look at this. She's got a couple of these in here. The little flips. Aren't these gorgeous? They're um, a seed envelope. Just beautiful. And look at this. Isn't this cute? It says lavender. Oh my gosh, Dawn, thank you so much. I am just blown away at how just vintagey and gorgeous the colors are. Look at this. And the way she's layered that up. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Cute little taggy. Oh, look at the little flash card. Just gorgeous. Beautiful, beautiful. I'm so blessed. And in my first video, too, I thank people um, for the YouTube community because, um, wow, there's so many fun, lovely people on YouTube, and that's what... Um, possessed me to start YouTube channel channeling is just for the community because everyone is so wonderful, so helpful. And like I said, um, Dawn gives so much of herself and I really thank you, Dawn, because you really go out of your way to do things just to be nice for others. And that's what really um, led me to ask her for the swap, to do the swap, because she's just such a kind, a giving person. And this is a little... Um, note um, added um, pad that she glued in and it's clipped. I don't want to take that apart. Um, I did. You'll see it in the other video if you look at the mess. <laughs> oh, and I think um, Lisa made this tag. I think she said, isn't that gorgeous? It's really beautiful. And there's Dawn's famous paper. Isn't that gorgeous? Wow, it's just, I just want to touch, touch, touch. And she didn't know this, but purple and green are my favorite two colors. So she's actually gotten the green that's perfect for me. I love greens. And look at this. Isn't this envelope amazing? The way she's flipped that. 
Wow. I just, oh my goodness, it's just so yummy. And look at this tag. And I think Lisa did this tag as well. It's embossed. It's just beautiful. Beautiful. And the polka dots. Let's see. No, I don't know what that one is. Look at this. Wow, I love that paper. And look at that tag. Isn't that gorgeous? Look at that. Oh, I just love it. I will put it back later. I just love what she's done here. It's just so perfect for me. Another um, garment pin with the beads. Just love it. Did I say I loved it? Did I tell you I love it? I love it. Look at this. Isn't this adorable? I don't know where she's gotten these labels, but they're so cool. They're so vintagey. So pretty. Look at this kind of a flip, the way it's stacked. And then this is in here. I showed this on the other video. It's um, the music that insects make. I love that. Love it. I love to sit outside at night in the summer and listen to the bugs. There we go. Look at this layering. Isn't this gorgeous? The way she has layered all of these colors. And this is some of Lisa's paper, the... Um, um, goodness, I forget what the flower is with the onion skins, but it's gorgeous. And the green construction paper there. I just love it. It's just amazing. All these goodies. I showed this in the faux pas video. That's what I call it, my faux pas video. And um, I think I told the story. She puts this um, in the back here. There's, um, I'll kind of jump to it. But... Um, this last piece, of course, the cute little Scotty dog. Oh, I'm, I missed it. It's an antique um, picture of a horse with an English saddle. And Oh, look, this is Lisa's paper, too. Isn't that gorgeous? Oh, that is beautiful. But um, I, I think I told the story when I was a kid. I didn't really own a saddle because I, I rode my pony bareback all the time and horses bareback and... Um, so when I finally um, worked my way up to a full-size horse, um, I wanted to ride English because um, I was so used to not riding with a saddle. And so, um, yeah, I rode English. So she's got a picture in here of an English um, antique saddle that is just beautiful. I put it back somewhere and now I can't find it. But it's in here and I love it, Dawn. Thank you so much. Um, thank you for visiting my channel, and I'm sorry that the first video was so messed up, but it, I posted it for two reasons. One, because I think it's hysterically funny that I messed it up so badly, but also it shows just how touched I really am and really was to, to get this from Dawn. I really did have tears in my eyes when I first opened it because it is just so perfect for me. I'm going to use this, and I will always cherish it. It's so wonderful to receive um, a homemade item from someone um, that you know, that you know or you've met. Um, it's just not the same when you make yourself something. I, I just don't appreciate, I guess, what I make. But to have someone else put something of themselves into a book just for me is so touching and so special. And I love it. And thanks, everyone, for watching. And um, I will be back. And thank you for my new subscriptions. I saw some people did do that. But, of course, um, everyone loves Dawn. So, you know, maybe a little bit more for Dawn than for me. But either way, I appreciate it. And thanks, everybody. Have a good day. Bye-bye.